we are now going to be finishing the middle part of the course, which is about resistance to colonialism. And uh, in week 11, we're going to go to the last third of the course, which is actually post-colonial literature. So for this week, I'm going to shift the schedule around a little bit. We read Things Fall Apart last week, but I saw that some of you um, had difficulty finishing the book in one week. So what we're going to do is I'm going to extend it to week 10. Uh, we're going to assign, I'm going to assign you a few more study questions to answer in your reading journals. With things fall apart, I'm going to record uh, a little video that follows this one here uh, about heroism and things fall apart, uh, just to give you a sort of a focus as you continue to read and think about this book. And um, I'm going to, uh, we're still going to read, um, there's an essay, There's No Such Thing as Commonwealth Literature um, from Imaginary Homelands, um, but the play that we were going to read this week, I'm going to make it optional extra credit, so if you want to read the play and write a journal entry about that, it's a fast play, it's a, a sex comedy, uh, The Lion and the Jewel by Wolf Sayinka, um, and it's, it, it's very funny. And usually when we do it in class, we have a lot of fun with it because we can um, assign parts to people and act them out. Since we're teaching asynchronously and not meeting, that's maybe not ideal for the semester. So we're gonna go ahead and make it optional um, this time around. So, so uh, I think that's it for overview. I'll uh, obviously write all this up and um, post it. I'll also remind you that uh, for the extra credits, there are various movies you can watch for extra credit as well. So um, you should have had that assignment already. Um, if you haven't, I'll just, if you haven't looked at it, I'll just highlight that one of the movies was Gandhi, which relates um, very directly to the Minal Hadrawala chapter Salt that we read recently about the Salt March um, and her relative who marched with Gandhi. Uh, another movie is Mississippi Masala. And that one is, um, it's, a, it's a romance uh, starring Denzel Washington and Serena Chowdhury. Um, it's a terrific movie. And why it's relevant to this course is um, that in part it's about uh, racial tensions between South Asians and Blacks in America, but it is uh, connected to um, uh, Indians who came to Africa and uh, that was how Sarita's father and his family um, originally came to Africa. And um, part of the tension of the movie is that he feels betrayed by Black people who kicked him out of his homeland. So when you're thinking about indenture um, and the kind of movements that we see in Living India, that movie is super relevant to that. And you might end up even wanting to write your final paper on that. Um, if that's a, an aspect of the course that intrigues you. So, okay, that's your overview for the week. And um, next is going to be a, a little video about um, uh, things fall apart. <laughs> All right.